Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and if you haven't already, hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button, and uh, that way you can join the Couch Gang and help us get to a thousand subs. Uh, so today we're going to be talking about um, kind of like an update on what's happening right now with, with the car and with the channel, and then we're also um, going to be mainly talking about this very tiny, small overlooked thing that you know is um is on most people's cars or is not on people's cars so what i'm talking about is like a license plate holder a lot of people just screw their license plates into the car and call it a day but as you know the edge of the uh, license plate is sharp and can kind of rub against your paint and ruin it so you might spend a lot of money trying to coat your car do all these different things and then this little thing rubbing on your car is gonna wear at it so what i did is i just picked up uh this item right here um, off Amazon the link is in the description but I did want to mention uh, what's going on with golf so right now I am uh, waiting on a few things uh, to align and we'll have a good amount of parts coming pretty soon uh, and we'll get them installed on the golf and then uh, I'll be slowly uh, doing reviews and um, kind of talking about my thought process on why I bought those parts um, so essentially we'll you know be uh, doing stage one and stage two builds over time uh, but I am kind of customizing, you know, what parts I use uh, based on uh, d plenty of different resources. I've spent hours, hours every day doing research on these. So um, I'm excited to share that guy, that, you know, that information with you. Um, so yeah, let's get back to the, the golf and see this uh, small little detail that a lot of people miss. Hey guys, so we're here with the golf outside. This is the product I ordered. This goes behind your plate and it cushions it. It also is, is breathable so um, no water gets stuck behind it as well. Um, so I'm gonna install this behind this. So I'm gonna take all this off first, and then um, I'm going to put this under and then put that back on. Um, and they give you like nice little caps and screws to do this whole thing with. So let's get to that. What I wanna show you guys is this. You can use a flathead. You gotta get in there and clip it out, and then you're gonna get two different little pieces like that. So let's go ahead and put that on and see how it looks. All right guys, look at how, look at how clean that looks. Got no plate cover, it's covering the back. If it, it won't rattle because of the rubber and it'll protect it. So I think that looks really good. Yeah. So I'll catch you guys back inside. Hey guys, when we're back inside, um, I do have a different shirt on because it's another day. Uh, the package was supposed to arrive on the day I made the video, but it didn't, so whatever. But out of that kit, if you do decide to buy that cheap kit that I put in the description. Um, not cheap, but like it just doesn't cost a lot. Um, I just wanted to go over something real quick with you guys. So these little guys here, um, I kind of talked about it earlier, but I want to kind of show you guys up close. So if you can see here, what's going to happen is, and these screws that it comes with might be too big for you. So I just reused the factory screws, but basically you put it so, um, see how that is? You put it like this, so it comes the flat side, not you know, is on the back, like that. And then you put it in, and then what you do is you clip it on top. And it might be, it might seem like common sense, but I figure I'd just save you guys the thought process. Um, you know, that way you don't have to go through it. So yeah, I mean, that's that's all there is to it. I think it's a great product to just kind of, you know, cover your bases with small things like that. It's 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 relatively inexpensive. Um, and I just kind of wanted to talk about it. And again, going back to the golf, there's a lot of stuff coming for it soon. Um, just awaiting uh, and shaping times, you know, with COVID things are a little bit slower, uh, but I'll keep bringing you guys content in the meantime. So I hope you liked the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up and subscribe and share and uh, help us get to a thousand subs and I'll catch you guys later.